say, well, Eva, I just want you guys to know that I am not at all upset that I was your third choice to be your officiant. <laughs> Okay, but if you're looking for an A plus effort today, you're not gonna get it, okay? You're gonna get a C plus at best, but I'm not mad and thank you for this honor. As I got to writing this, I started thinking, what is love? And I had pages and pages of what is love, what is the meaning of love, to a total of about 15 pages. But Will and Eva said, Father Paul, this needs to be short and sweet. Classy, family friendly, and keep it PG. So my 15 pages got cut down to a paragraph. But this is what love is. Is it just a feeling? Is it the soul's recognition of its counterpart in another? Is it the feeling of you complete me? It's that first date feeling with him being extremely handsome and funny and the most beautiful eyes you've ever seen. It's that first date feeling that she looks amazing in that sundress. You don't want to stop talking to her and you don't want the night to end. And then it grows to moments when you get to know the person and seeing how funny and witty he is how he makes you feel and can always cheer you up when you have a bad day, how he loves animals as much as you and even gives them more treats than you, <laughs> and how well he fits in with your family. And for him, it's seeing how passionate you are, how thoughtful and caring, how you decorated his hospital room for him for Halloween, how you love all animals, how amazing you are and how you take care of him because Lord knows he can't take care of himself. <laughs> But in the end, it's these feelings and moments like nothing else in the world matters when you're with them. As you hold their hand and look at them, you can't wait to spend the rest of your life with them. You found your person, that's love, and that's what we're celebrating here today. Do you will take this woman to be your wife, to love her, to honor her, to comfort her, to protect her, in sickness and in health, forsaking all others, for as long as you both shall live, even when she makes you do the dishes and then redoes them after you do them, and even when she wants a vast amount of goats and chickens and animals at your new house? I do. <laughs> Eva, do you take this man to be your husband, to love him, to honor him, to comfort him, to protect him in sickness and in health, forsaking all others, for as long as you both shall live, even when he leaves his wet towels on the bedroom floor and has his clothes inside out when you do laundry and potentially loses his ridiculous good looks when he gets older. I'm gonna say hell yes. All right, I'll take it. I do. I do, okay. And now, by the power vested in me by the state of Ohio, it is my honor to declare you married. You may seal this declaration with a kiss. You may kiss the bride. I am honored to present the newlyweds, Will and Eva Pizeski. One of the first times that I spent an extended amount of time with our beautiful couple, I had just gotten my hair done. <laughs> I thought it looked really good. We got into the elevator, and when Will saw it, he told me whatever I did to my hair did not look good, and I should change it. In perfect Eva fashion, she didn't even notice it. Will and I took some time after that to become friends. <laughs> Over the last few years, we gotten past this elevator incident, and we have become very great friends, and I honestly love him like a brother, just as I love Eva as my sister. I can see so many reasons why Eva has chosen to spend the rest of her life with Will. He loves being an animal dad, hiking with Eva in velvet, and he knows how to make Eva feel loved, special, and make her laugh. So thank you all for being here to celebrate our beautiful couple. Please raise your glasses and join me in congratulating Eva and Will to a happily ever after.
have to realize that, that back during this time frame, Will dressed kind of like, like he sold used Mazdas. <laughs> <laughs> he had on a, a white v-neck shirt. And, and if you ever commented on just how deep his v-neck shirt went, he would turn to you and just say, Deep V. <laughs> I mean, Eva had only grown more beautiful and resilient and loving. And Will, Will had also grown. And I'm not just talking about how much the Morella family feeds him. <laughs> Will, had, Will had ditched his, his multiple class rings. He had, he had given up. He wears suits now. He replaced the rings with something far more important. A ring symbolizing his love for you. Oh. That brings us to today. This obscene amount of family and friends all gathered here to celebrate the love you guys have today and for the many years to come. <laughs>